Captain Jim here with Nav Mode. Remember to check out our app on Google Play. It's coming soon for Apple products. Nav Mode is owned and operated by sailors just like yourself. So when it comes time to study for U.S. Coast Guard exams, it's a great tool to have. And here at Nav Mode, we know what you need. Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to determine the course made good given the speed and direction of the current and the vessel's course and speed. The question will be pulled directly from the U.S. Coast Guard database. Um, you'll need your standard tools such as a radar plotting sheet, parallel rulers, dividers, and a sharp number two pencil. Okay, so first off, I like to label the center of my plotting sheet as zero, 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 zero. Then, the question that we're going to use as an example today, we will be using the 12 nautical mile scale. The question states, you are underway on course 160 degrees true at 10 knots. The current is 210 degrees true at 0.9 knots. What is the course made good? So first off, from your center or your 0000, zero, zero, zero position, plot your course line which was 160. So, line your rulers up at the center and 160. And draw your line. Okay. Now, in one hour, you traveled 10 nautical miles because the vessel is traveling at 10 knots. So, once again, using the 12 mile scale, Mark out 10 miles on your dividers, which will put you directly on the last range marker, as you can see. So this is 10 miles. So in one hour, so this would be your 0, 100 position, you are here. Dead reckoning. Okay, now the question states the current is 210 degrees true at 0.9 knots. So, line your parallels up with the center and 210. Then walk them over to your 0100 dead reckoning position. And from your 0100 position, draw a line in the direction the current is traveling. This is very important. If you went this way, obviously it would put your boat here. The current is traveling this way, so make sure you draw it in the direction the current is traveling. Okay, now, same goes for the current. In one hour, the current traveled 0.9 miles because it is traveling at 0.9 knots. So. Again, mark out 0.9 nautical miles on your dividers. Then from your 0, 100 position on your current line, mark out 0.9 miles. Mark the position. And this creates your current vector. So once again, from the center to your current vector, line up your parallels then draw a line to determine course made good as you can see the line passes directly through 164 degrees true which is your course made good thanks for tuning in hope this else helped remember to like nav mode on Facebook and if you have any other types of questions, comments, uh, things that you need worked out, um, feel free to drop us a line and we will do our best to get a video up as soon as possible. Once again, thanks for tuning in.